In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to differentiate y equals ln x to the power of x. Now, I'm first going to take the natural logarithm of both sides of this equation. So we end up with ln y is equal to ln ln x to the power of x. Now, as this exponential x is over here, right, we can pull it out. So we get ln y is equal to x multiplied by ln ln x, okay? Now, we can say, okay, that u is a function of x and that v is a function of x. And we can say that the derivative of this side of this equation is going to be equal to u multiplied by dv over dx plus v multiplied by du over dx. Okay? And to differentiate this side of this equation, we are going to use implicit differentiation. Now, before we differentiate this whole equation, okay, we are going to say that u is equal to x. And this means that du over dx is going to be equal to 1. We are also going to say that v is equal to ln ln x, okay, which is equal to ln p. Now dv over dp is going to be 1 over p, which is 1 over ln x. p itself is equal to ln x. Therefore, dp over dx is equal to 1 over x. Now using the chain rule, we are going to get dv over dx. So let's multiply dv over dp by dp over dx. And that is going to be equal to 1 over x times ln x, okay? And this is equal to dv over dx. Now, as we have the value of u, dv over dx, v and du over dx, we can now differentiate this equation. So we're going to use implicit differentiation to differentiate this side of this equation. So we're going to get 1 over y times dy over dx is equal to u, what is the value of u? It's x times dv over dx, which is 1 over x times ln x, okay, plus v, which is equal to ln ln x. Okay, times du over dx, which is equal to 1. Now, as we have an x at the top of this fraction and an x at the bottom of this fraction, we can cancel out these x's over here. Okay, so we get 1 over y times dy over dx is equal to 1 over ln x plus ln ln x, okay? Now, what are we going to do from here? Well, we're going to multiply both sides of this equation by y so that we can isolate dy over dx. So I'm going to multiply this side of this equation by y and I'm also going to do the same to this side of this equation. 
So we get dy over dx is equal to y multiplied by this value inside these brackets. But what is y again? Well, y is ln x to the power of x. So we get dy over dx is ln x to the power of x, okay, times 1 over ln x plus ln ln x in brackets. So we've differentiated y equals ln x to the power of x. And this is our final result. Thank you for watching this video.